morning. Oh yeah. What a day yesterday. <laughs> Almost 26 miles and seven over 7,000 feet of ascent. That's, yeah, that was a big day. I'm glad I survived. <laughs> Today is hopefully gonna be way easier, but we'll see when the day's over. Planning on doing about 25 miles again today. Elevation, as I said yesterday, is just over 2,000. I'm not sure if it's 2,800 or something, but yeah, it's not much. Oh yeah. Beautiful morning. Small clouds up there. It's a little chilly right now, but I slept without my liner last night and had no problems at all. So that's pretty cool. I'll try again tonight just to figure out if I really need it or if it's just mainly when cowboy camping that it's super, super nice. It, it is nice no matter what, but if I'm not cold or get any drafts or anything, uh, there's no point in carrying 250 grams around it's Yeah, as I also said yesterday, sounds stupid to worry about such small weights, but 250 gram is, is quite a lot um, in the grand scheme of things. I tried looking at the uh, the app yesterday to to see the route and it kind of looks like in about 19 or 20 miles we are road walking the rest of the way into Steamboat Springs which would make that oh yeah so 5 miles more and then it's about 12 Between 12 and 15 miles of road walking, I, <laughs> I'm not really sure. But if that's freaking stupid. So, but yeah, that's how it is. But I have decided that if I get picked up by someone asking me for a ride, I'm gonna take it. Just gonna skip that road walk. But I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna try to hitch. So we will let fate decide what is going to happen. <laughs> there is nothing to see on that road walk. It is just a road. Uh, so I'm not gonna miss anything except for a continuous footpath. But you can put that while the sun doesn't shine because I had to skip New Mexico anyway. So. That continuous footpath is kind of long gone. But we'll see. We'll see. Road walk is... It's a little hard on your feet, but it's not physically hard. It could be, could be done fairly quickly. I mean, 15 miles. Let's just say it's 15 miles. Divided by four miles an hour. So that's four hours, just under four hours. But that's on top of the 20 miles I'm gonna hike in here, which is probably more like two and a half. So that's 10 hours, that's 15 hours. I won't be able to make it tonight anyway, so it doesn't really matter. I'll probably just walk it. I just got about Five mosquito bites on my ass. Oh yeah. I had to take a poop. While I was doing that, there was just one annoying mosquito swarming around my head to take off or to distract me from the fact that all his friends just went straight for my ass instead. Oh, 
I hate, hate mosquitoes. Uh, hopefully they will soon be done. Oh yeah, uh, great. <laughs> awesome. Well, that's how it is out here in nature. Snot and everything. About three miles in, uh, this trail turned into like a forest service road, whatever it's called. And I have a sneaky suspicion that when I get to mile 19, this is just gonna turn into a real road walk, which is just, ugh. So that's about 32 miles of road walking to get to Steamboat Springs, or at least to the pass where you get a hitch. Oh yeah, that's so great. I thought we were done with the, uh, with the road walking. But at least you can walk pretty fast. And so far it's, there was a little bit of climb this morning, but otherwise it's mostly been downhill, so. I am doing great mileage today. I might even make it all the way to Steamboat Springs in time for dinner, um, but we'll see. The, uh, the trail so far has been so easy to hike that I managed to do 15 miles and it's one minute to 10. <laughs> That's pretty insane. Uh, and I started at six o'clock by hiking. Well, at six o'clock I started filtering water, but same thing. So in four hours I did 15 miles. That's I don't know if that's a record for me, <laughs> but also the trail has been very boring. Nothing really to photograph. So that's probably also one of the reasons why I managed to just hike through that fast. Oh yeah. Well, well, I might even, or I will make it to Steamboat Springs today. That's for sure because it's just another 20 miles <laughs> of road walk. <sighs> we'll see, I, yes, I will. I will get into town today. Just, yeah, put in some music and then just run through that shit. Oh, yeah. I made it, oh, freaking flies all over. Oh, I made it to the highway and it's just gonna be a long, boring road walk. So I am just plugging in <laughs> my headphones and we'll start the music and yeah, I'm not gonna video or take any pictures unless there's something extremely interesting along the way. So I will see you guys in Steamboat Springs. Oh yeah. I made it to Steamboat Springs, got a hotel room, and now I am going to Walmart. Oh whatever is up there to get resupply for the next four days even though riverside and 
slash encampment is the next uh, uh, yeah uh, city. Well, I and it's a full, it's an 80 mile hike. I looked at the elevations and figured that if I'm gonna do 25 mile days and get there in like three and a half. Jesus, there's a lot of traffic. Sorry about that. There we go. Uh, traffic. Uh, traffic. Um, yeah, 25 mile days. It's gonna be some uh, some big elevation gain. So I got a little scared that I might not be able to do that. It's just like 5,500 or something is the lot. Yeah, I, I'm, I don't know. So I'm gonna do four days. And if I get there in uh, three and a, a half, that's just perfect. But also tomorrow, when I leave Steamboat again, I don't think I'll be able to do 25 miles, which is also one of the reasons. So I'm counting on a 15 mile day tomorrow and then see how, how it goes. Four days is not bad. And I kind of already <coughs> saved half a day or maybe even a day by getting to steamboats today instead of tomorrow which is yeah that's pretty pretty crazy that i was able to do that but yeah it was <laughs> way too easy today for some reason i i think there have, there might have been kryptonite or something in the not kryptonite but there might have been something stronger than protein in my uh, in my dinner yesterday <laughs> i don't know yeah well we we'll see four days of food and if i make it before i make it before so pretty nice